get off. Saurav Ganguly is bumped into the ball and he's going to direct it at the striker. Well, this could be close because he could be in the air. That is, that is going to be tight. And is the foot in the air? Has he grounded it? Because he's made no effort. It's the right decision. Well, it's gone through not to Mola. It's the in cutter again. Mashrafi Murtaza is delighted. He knows it's a big one. And the Bangladesh supporters also go up. It's been disappointing yet again for Mahindra Seba. You're out of form. He comes in. Bottom edge. It's not the shot. It's not the time. And India lose their first wicket. A big breakthrough for Bangladesh. These are easy pickings. Once you stray down the leg side, you give that batsman a little bit more time. Then he's just marginally short leg. Mutapa has put it up. In the air, it's gone. Slashed at it, took the outside edge, flew to the man at time. So the Bangladesh is certainly on fire to start off with. Robin Mutapa, the man who. Mutapa, the young batsman, chases the ball. Ball that's moving around just enough. Two strikes. Just look at these boys, Bangladesh. That's worked away beautifully. Just trying onto the pads, and Tinduk is so good in that area. Oh, that's nicely bowled. That's gone. What a start for Abdul Razak. He has picked up Sachin Tinduk at the big pitch. And they are on a roll. Simply and it's on to pad and then taken by the wicketkeeper. Yes, good catch. Wasn't that difficult, it just went straight over the stumps, but he kept his focus on what was happening. And a good breakthrough. That has raced off the bat of Saurav Ganguly. Mohamed Rafiq starts well and in the up goes the finger, he's picked up a wicket with... Did he get an edge to it? Oh, it's hard to tell from that because it, uh, it hit in line and looked like it was hitting. That is a big wicket. India in trouble. As well, Hawkeye says it's going to hit. So the captain gone. Miles. That's gone miles. This is not a small ground and it's gone into the top deck. Into the middle. Enjoy that. What a shot. First up I found Muhammad the figure had the pulled it up actually from uh, outside the off some. Oh, top deck. Top edge should be taken. And he's taken. That is a good wicket. Yeah. We're starting to step up the pace. Played a lovely slot sweep. I think it was a couple of overs ago into the middle tier of the stands. And... Good catch. Very simply held. So often happens that when a partnership forms and one batsman. Was short, should have been put away, but didn't time it well. Hit him straight to the fielder. Um, Abdul Razak taking a catch, soft dismissal. Big gone. Three wickets have fallen for just a couple of runs. Well, take a look at that. Mohammad Rafiq once again picking up a big wicket. Mahinda Singh Dhoni hitting it straight to the fielder at short third. No problems whatsoever. Aftab Ahmed taking the catch. And he's played on. He's played it on. The spinners are doing a fabulous job here at Port of Spain. Down. Really? The stumps are all over the place and India's innings is all over the place at the moment. And he strikes straight away. Good pace, good lift, great line. And good. It's good lift for a loop.
Lusna really. He has been up. End of the innings. Is that a change of pace? Yes, it's a come down in pace. Good change up from Mortza. And a nifty little partnership of 32 of 28 runs between Zahir and Patel comes to an end. So does the Indian innings. Really got the seed. Had to reach, stretch. Easy catch. But an absolutely critical, valuable partnership. 32, the second equal highest of the innings. India managing just 191, getting all out in the 50th over. Saurav Ganguly played a laborious, uncharacteristically slow innings of 66-7. For the Minos Bangladesh, Mashrafi Murtaza was the wrecker in chief with figures of 4 for 38. That's beautifully struck. That really is a good omen for Bangladesh. A half volley, but uh, there was wet. And most batsmen like to make use of it. There's no second thoughts here. It's wet. That's hammered. Beautiful shot. Well, a lot about batting in these. If you're an opener, just picking the right ball to hit. Wow, that's four wides. You'll love those. Four no balls, in fact. No balls are wide. Buys. Point they are, but still very, very useful runs. Slash from that, but um, if you do hit it firmly in that direction, with the field standing inside the ring, there's always runs to be made. This is an attitude in how to win a game of cricket. There's a bad ball there, you hit it. Good shot. Love splits on the up again, but no doubt. No... That Looks must strong. be out. Yes, it is. Had it on. Zahir can bring the ball back in. Height would be the only question. But, uh, well, the umpire thought otherwise. Can get a bit of bounce, but uh, Hawkeye says just enough. India. That's a great shot. An excellent reply. On the back foot, punches it through the offside square of the wicket. Charged on it, and what, what guts, he's not going to get intimidated by the short one. Four runs, eight runs on that over, 35 for one. This is what you could do. They're not going to get uh, affected by any way. Great shot, it was in the air for a while. Zahir Khan threw his arms in the air. A shout of catch it. 50 up for Bangladesh, the only catching will be when Dravid throws the ball back. Yeah, 50 on the board, 50 for one in the 11th over. Bangladesh need 142 to win this so important game for them. this it belies a 17 year old really showing very little respect to the elder statesman because he's soon going to be his bedtime just look at this cracking shots Taya Khan around the wicket Tommy Mitbell dances down the pitch And they showed some good reasons why today. Runs are hemorrhaging. Well, this is terrific stuff. It's not great if you're an Indian player or a spectator. These Bangladeshi boys are having fun. Dropped it. 50. For it, Bell. 12 overs gone, 67 for one. Well played, terrific effort. 51 from 51, seven fours, two sixes. Dancing in the stands, there is some good support here for Bangladesh. Got him. Patel has his revenge. Very good delivery. 
He delivers from very close to the stumps. Just enough movement. It's good delivery. It's not too much he can do against this. Is he guiding it past slip? I'm not so sure. I think it's an excellent ball. Donny does the rest. A bit of disappointment. Let's put it away much better this time. Harbhajan Singh has no chance whatsoever in the deep. Raced away to the fence. What a cracking shot that was. Big appeal. This could be tight. Alindar is taking his time and up goes the finger. It wasn't a good shot at all under the circumstances. What a spectacular boundary. The last delivery that he played and a poor shot in the end. Gunab Patel is the man for India at the moment. Pitched up delivery and uh, after just trying to hit it, uh, missing it completely. And when you miss that kind of delivery, you've got to go back to the pavilion. Heading him straight, that's it. Had a good piece of bowling from Manav Patel. Picks up his second wicket. Good strike. Very good strike. Manav Patel, the fielder, will not get to it. Much needed boundary to break the shackles and ease the pressure. That's hammered away. Don't bother running for it. Magnificent shot. Sakibul Hassan, the batsman, always looked a lot more elegant when a left-hander plays the shot. That's a cracking shot. Picked it up really nicely. Off the back foot. Down the ground. What an audacious shot that was. Took the ball around and straight over. Great six. Like that. Beautiful shot, very positive. Raheem flighted. Never so slightly, but on the up. Really hit. He's guided that quite nicely. There's an unbridled ability about the way Bangladesh have batted. That's going to go safely. Well, I'm sure that the ruling is if the ball hits the boundary rope, it's six runs. It's right underneath our commentary position. The third umpire has been called upon to adjudicate. I think this bounce is straight on the rope. All along the ground. Doesn't get better. Great execution of the shot. Yet another boundary, 14th of the innings. Straight the big shot, no protection in the deep on the leg side. And it's gone the distance. Just about when now you talk about the appearing pressure from the bowling bat, look at that shot. That's an absolutely outstanding shot from that little man, Moshfiq Rahim. He went to bat in number three and take a look at that shot. Down on his knees and bang. All the way. Huge six. Just one boundary, but two sixes in his innings. Miscue. That is gone the distance. He's looking for the biggie. Normally puts it a long distance away. Just clearing the ropes. But the important thing, he was hitting with the turn. Brings up his half century. Brings up his half century with uh, a huge six. Just talking about that, but there's no turn, so there's ample time for him to go down the track, make some room, and get him over the top of the cover. That is it. That could be gone. Yes, Dhoni does well. Has it come at the right time, or has it come a little too late? The change of bowler working for India, but in the Seva, has provided the breakthrough. It's been a good partnership. Well, is this the turning point? We're in the survival in his very first over. Gets Sakibul Hassan stumped. He goes up in the air. That's a great shot. Takes the challenge and uh, picks up a boundary. He excellent use of the feet. And he hit it straight, presenting the full face of the bat. It's the safest shot to play straight down the ground. The shot delivery has been put away. Tendulkar in the deep. Can't cut it off. Excellent execution of a difficult shot. Mushfiqur Rahim, take a look at that shot. That was the short, wide and 
Okay, that had to go up on his toes and played that beautifully away from Sachin Dalitko who's feeling at the third man. Gone. That's the second one. Habibul Bashar just wanted to hit it over the top of the fielder. I think that's good captaincy when he had both the fielders inside the circle at mid on and mid off. And but in the server has done the trick again for India. Not a very good shot. And as a captain, you want to bat till the very end. He was looking to hit in the direction of wide long on. Laid down the wrong line. There was a bit of turn. Good stop. Oh, that will do. Terrific shot. Stand and deliver four. Ten to win, Bangladesh. Four with both arms. A new signal for the umpires and the ICC. He can barely smile. Happy Bulbasha is close. He wants to restrain himself. I wonder how special the feeling was from Luna Patel at cover. There's it past him. <laughs> Straight underneath him. He is not one that you'd hope to be at cover. He's not a good feeler. He's not a good athlete. He's a good bowler. Very silent shot. Yes, hands in the air. It's gone through. What an innings. What a day for Bangladeshi cricket. Is it their biggest moment yet? Well, only time will tell, but it is certainly a wonderful way to start their World Cup 2007 campaign, not for India. Take a bow, Bangladesh. You'd have a heck of a day today. You've been terrific. Watch the thing.